All right, joining us via the phone lines. Uh, we're going to go ahead and uh, play the music first. Right yes. Now, so All right. Have... This is uh, this is uh, Solo D. Solo D. Works rap with the Solo D. His uh, brand is DWA. Doll fans with attitude. We want to talk to him about his music. Want to talk to him about where the Dolphins fans are right now because it's been quite the disappointment. Well, and you listen to this song. And and I, I I can tell you right now, Solo D I don't think represents the average Miami Dolphin fan because he's got a lot of hope and energy. All right, let's... behind that team, check it out. Solo D, Solo D, Solo D, Solo D, Solo D, Solo D. Live from the forty-two. I'm good, man. I don't know. D Miami Sports Music Salute. Bless up. We got finger licking live. Happy New Year. Let's get it, bro. Slow it down. Slow it down. On June 1st, Solo D came into this world. Born in Virginia, his family moved to Jacksonville, Florida. His family was very artistic with acting and music. So by age six, Solo D was rapping and making beats on a keyboard and recording into a karaoke machine. By age nine, his family had moved from Jacksonville to Miami, and Solo D had become a fan of the Miami Dolphins. By 1999, he considered himself a die-hard fan. His love of music and his favorite football team were always separate in his life until 2010. Miami Sports Music, which was established in 2010, has grown to over 11 countries in all 50 states here in the U.S. In 2010, Sun Life Stadium began playing Solo D's weekly theme songs during pre-game player warm-ups and the players started getting wind of what Solo D was doing and loved it and got behind it. Miami Dolphins, y'all already know. Hey, right now. What's up, man? I'm Mike Pouncey. I'm with Rashad Jones. Shout out to DWA. We'll be back next week. Yes, sir. Hey, make sure you sign up to be a member of MiamiSportsMusic.com. All right? Yeah. Let's go. That's what with this dude here. Look what that say. It's DWA. Those with attitude? Dolphins with attitude. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, what's up? This your boy, Kendall Langford of the Miami Dolphins. Uh, shout out to my man, Solo D with the Miami Dolphin music. Keep doing your thing, man. You're holding it down over there for us, man. Dolphin Nation fans up all day, baby. You already know. Yo, what up? This Will Allen from the Miami Dolphins. Give a shout out to Solo D, Miami Dolphin music. I'm saying keep putting out them hits, boy, because we're showing up putting out them hits. Getting in work. This is Brian Hartland with the Miami Dolphins. I want to give a shout out to Solo D, Miami Dolphin music. Yeah, this your boy Jay Allen. I want to send a special shout out to my boy Solo D, who's bringing a heat to Miami Dolphin music. You do your thing, my boy. This is Noah Carroll, the Miami Dolphins. Shout out to Solo D, Miami Dolphin music. Like most statements and slogans Solo D comes up with, the excerpts are from some of the lyrics of his songs. Dolphins with attitude. DWA was founded in 2013 once Solo D realized he shares the same aggressive passion for the Miami Dolphins that thousands of other fans across the world do. And they aren't scared to show it, no matter where they may be from. New York, Atlanta, Pennsylvania, Virginia, Rhode Island, to California. There are Dolphin fans across the country that represent the Dolphins even though they may be surrounded by opposing fans. Solo D feels that it's his job as a super fan and artist to be aggressive, not violent, but passionate in sharing for his favorite football team. What's up, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy, Stephen Dean. I'm sitting here with my man, Solo D. We're on the set of week 13, MetLife Takeover, Dolphin Music with the man himself, Solo D. Solo, man, what's going on, bro? Yeah, I'm feeling good, man. What inspired you to do it? What made you wake up one day and say, you know what, I want to give something back to the fans? You know what, man? It was, I was doing it as a fan. 
we were playing the Jets. It was 2010 season. And that's the year we started off. Two and up. Uh, it's crazy. The first time I did it, we lost. <laughs> <laughs> we ended up losing. Most, to the most Dolphin fans' first experiences with a loss. So yeah, it's all man. good. It was. So it was the year. And I was just making it just to talk bad about the Jets. Because, you know, the Dolphins fans. That's how it is. Yep. The rivalry. I was just making a rivalry sign. I didn't plan on making a song every week or like that. So it came out like that, and it was actually a horrible song, too. I was listening to it. But it was cool. I just messed around with it. You know what I mean? In 2011, Solo D was requested by the super fan group, the Thin Addicts, and the defense section of Sun Life Stadium to open the season for Monday Night Football. It was then that the Dolphins organization contacted him to perform at the pre-game concert. Since then, Solo D has performed at over 20 pre-game home and away shows. He has also performed at sports bars across the country for Dolphin fan clubs. All I'm doing is talking trash, friendly, you know, nothing, nothing too crazy. I don't curse in any of the music, but you know, I'm saying I'm speaking, I'm a voice for the Dolphins fans, like, I'm saying what we feel. It's like you feel like you're at home. When you're in this section, or you're in the section of the stadium, you feel like you're in the stadium, so. Ego and Michelle really put this together, it's crazy, it's amazing. Yeah, a lot of people don't realize, and, and I've been fortunate uh, enough to, to be on Facebook and talk to a lot of different fans. Your music helps get a lot of people through, you know, those tough weeks. I mean, we're going through a tough stretch right now. Appreciate it. And and at the end of the day, you know, Miami Dolphin music has been uh, has been, I guess, the gospel of of Dolphins of the Dolphins fan base right now, man. Uh, Solo D and Miami Sports Music has grown into a large movement with a fan base of Dolphin fans that love his talent and consistent loyalty of dropping weekly Dolphin songs every week. He gets invited by Dolphin fan clubs across the world to perform and showcase his talent. Fans invite him to their tailgates to eat, drink, and most of all, perform his songs. He has fans from Miami to Maine, from Cali to Europe, all the way to Africa. All Dolphins fans want is to hang out and share their love of the Dolphins with someone who best represents them and how they feel. At the end of 2015, Solo D hit a milestone, 100 songs, 100 songs to show every Dolphin fan his dedication and loyalty of his favorite football team. And I never missed the opportunity to say the Jets up. And we ain't got no words Okay, my squad went to New Orleans They cooked us up like Cajun Drew Brees, he played amazing And Darren Spoles was blazing All the DBs took a vacation Our fans ain't get enough blazing So we gon' take all the frustration And ball out of them Ravens Fans like, oh, they fans like, oh That's how them Dolphins roll Critics wonder why the season never died They thought that we was done We creeping from the side We ain't never scared Fans with an attitude, we gon' snow on the field like we mad at you. Hey, your team looking different like a glass of brew. Now we got the pets up, and we gotta act 
Fucked up, attacked them like a Mack truck and sent them back out to Massachusetts where the last game was bad luck. But now we at home and those hoes we got a patch. Oh, I forgot about Big Ben. Can't forget about Rockenberg. And they offense, we not scared. We back slapping like Ike Turn. I know I do that trash talk, but truly I'm just having fun. Dolphin fans to the copper slam. Dolphin fans, we number one. We don't care about them yellow flags. Man, my team got hella swag. We gon' make they fans hella mad. Then send them home in a yellow cab. Dolphin fans, don't change. Heating up no propane If we go hard, it's no thing Sunday, no game Organizations can go out and hire famous musicians for thousands of dollars to perform at halftime shows But Solo D's the artist that before, during, and after the game lets his loyalty, passion, and dedication of his favorite football team speak through the lyrics of his music Solo D and Miami Sports Music has been able to create an atmosphere that most teams dream about for their fan bases. So no matter how the season goes, 1 in 15 or 17 and 0, Solo D and Miami Sports Music will get better and better and fans will never quit no matter what the product on the field is because there's always next year. Go hard or go home, home. we all family, yeah. one time for Mad Dog. Mad Dog. 